Why is it important for you to support the Bentonville Film Festival? First of all, what a great opportunity to come to Bentonville. Let's start there, one of the most beautiful cities I've ever seen. And uh, my husband has done business with Walmart for years, and he goes to Bentonville all the time. And, you know, I finally get to come here and celebrate with him, so that was great. And I don't, it's just the, the themes about women and diversity and getting out there and doing something creative and remembering your story and, and you know, just just being able to get with other filmmakers and the people and, and, you know, the people who are interested in films, the students that were here today at the panel discussion. So it's just a special time and, and I'm so grateful for this opportunity. And thank you, Gina Davis. So you've had an amazing long career. What do you say to new actors starting out, especially women? Oh, you know what? You can spend so much time trying to figure out what they want, and you just end up, you know, I, you hear this all the time, but no one is going to do you better than you. So if someone's in the market for what you have to offer, no one's going to do it better. So why not just become the best version of yourself in terms of what you want to be and represent in the world? One of the main themes about this film festival is social change and inclusion. How do you think the film industry can be more inclusive? Well, first of all, I think that, uh, you know, just having festivals like this is amazing because it, it brings it to the foreground. And I think that with all the different delivery systems that we have now, it's so important to be able to have, to, to like say, okay, maybe I'm not going to get a huge blockbuster feature, which is they're more, mostly interested in franchises to bring people out to the theater, but maybe I can do a smaller thing. What am I passionate about? What am I trying to, you know, and don't just feel like you have to think in terms of stereotypes. What are you most looking forward to this week at the film festival? Well, showing the movie Imperfections, I'm so excited. Meeting the people at the book signing, you know, and uh, and just feeling like, just, just getting a, more of a flavor of Bentonville and, and the other filmmakers and what they brought here.